And St. Landry Parish College seemed out of reach for the Valley Victorian of Port Berry High School until she, she received one of the country's most prestigious scholarships. As Iman Boyd reports, that scholarship will allow her to be the first in her family to go to college. Xavier. Xavier was the first. Sedonia Davis' grades and hard work have attracted dozens of scholarship offers for the high school senior, racking up more than a million dollars worth of scholarship funds, including the Gates Millennium Scholarship. She's one of 300 students in the U.S. chosen for the scholarship and the second student at Port Berry High to receive it. It's pretty much a full ride to any school that I want to go to in the United States. So I'm really excited and happy to know that I'll get to go to school without any loans. Davis plans to attend Tulane University in New Orleans and major in pre-med. She's the first person in her immediate family to attend college. I'm really grateful for the opportunities. I'm also a first generation student, so this is all new to me. My mom's a single parent as well, so you know, it was a lot of moving around and things as well, like with financial stability. But you know, I didn't let that stop me from you know, getting my successes and working hard in anywhere that I ended up. While her high school career is over, she's preparing to give her class one final message as valedictorian. I have to write a speech and honestly didn't start yet, but it's okay. Diamonds are made under pressure. That's my motto. <laughs> In St. Landry, Iman Boyd, KTC TV3. So what does it take to be a Gates Scholar? Recipients must have graduate in the top 10% of their class. They must also demonstrate leadership ability through community service, extracurriculars, or other activities. They must show perseverance and other skills of success.